Hi everybody, it's Heidi with the Weathered Fence Post. Welcome to our channel. If you're new to our channel, one of the things that we love to do here is we love to take you along hunting for treasures, and that's exactly what we're going to do today. Joanne with Bat Thrift Crazy and our good friend Kelly and, the, and myself were called the Thrifteteers. We decided to go out hunting. Actually, I kind of decided it because I wanted to go back to the Beacon Rescue Mission to see if I could find the top to those fairy lamps. So we were headed out to go that direction. And before we did that, we were invited to go to a private pick by Pam and Bill. What a great couple. We had a great time with them. I didn't film in their home just for personal reasons. I, I don't like, I like to respect people's privacy in their home, but I, in our next video, I will go over all the fantastic pieces that we got from them. We had a great time visiting with them. And I do believe they have an Etsy shop and I'm going to reach out to Pam and see if I can get the link to that Etsy shop and share it with you on our next video. We went from there down to the Beacon Rescue Mission thrift store, though I didn't find the fairy lamp tops, I found some great things. And then we went on to Paul Mart in Dunn. I wanted to take the girls down there to check that out. And I did some more filming for you down there, like I said I would. And we had some lunch and then we hit another thrift stop called Saks Thrift Avenue. It was an expensive stop. Only found a few items in there, but man, was that place packed. So let's get going. The thing that we like to do the most, let's go hunting, let's go find some treasures. We just, I'm with the Thrifteteers today, and we just finished our first, it was a private pick. I didn't want to film, I try to respect people's homes and didn't film in their home, but I got a picture for you, which I will put up right here and show you their picture. Great couple. We had a blast there meeting them and going through everything they had good pricing for us i got a whole bin full of great stuff this is really pretty global girlfriend women made fair trade it says it was 32 dollars i like the look of that but what is it I don't understand. It's like, I don't know what it is. It's pretty. These lamps are pretty. Really pretty. Anybody need a helmet? <laughs> This little lady. Now this is pretty. What do you think about that, Joanne? That's pretty. Yeah, it's 15 bucks. How much? 15. 15. Yeah. yeah. The shade's kind of cool. It's a cool shade for three dollars. I like the unique look of that. And I was looking at these owls. I think these are cute. Two seventy nine for that one, and two seventy nine for that one. I think they're really cute. I think I might get those. Just came across these great. I love these for two dollars with the horses. I think that's a great content piece. Anything with horses usually does pretty well, so I'm definitely going to get that. These are pretty. They've got some nice art glass pieces in here today. Some fused glass. Yeah, it's all from the same. Let's see what else we got here. Let me drop everything and work on your problem. Nope, not going to happen. Not going to happen. Unless, you know, you're in a really bad situation. I definitely would drop everything and help you out, but... Okay, now I'm looking for a lamp shade to go with the eagle lamp. Now this might work. Oh, it's not in the best condition, though. Yeah, I'm going to pass on that. But I do have to keep my eyes open for a lamp shade for that. Okay, we're back at Beacon Rescue Mission, trying to find the tops to those fairy lamps. I do want to show you. Hi, everybody. Found this. 
pretty mirror and it's on these. These are great. Love these. Look at them. Um, aren't those awesome? There's Sirocco. They're so pretty. I love them. Perfect for the fall. But we'll see. I don't think, I think the fairy lamp tops are gone, unfortunately. But there's still great stuff here, so I'm going to see what they got. It's a nice bottom to a planter. Cute little vase for 25 cents. Purses and hexes. Oh, that's cute. That's cute for a dollar. <laughs> Oh, I'm so bummed out that those aren't here. I really messed that up. That's still here. <laughs> these are cute. They look like they might be from the 90s. Let's look. I'm going to look at the bottom of that. Look at this fantastic piece that I just found. This is fantastic. Wow, I love it. Wow, it's signed even. This is a great find right here. Absolutely beautiful. Definitely going right there in the basket. Thought I would check over here in the clear vases. I don't usually pick up clear vases, but I like the shape on that one. I think that's got a cool shape to it. And I've got some decor that I think would look really nice in that. So I think I'm gonna get that to put that decor in. Look at all these tall. Those are really nice. This is a unique candle holder. I like the look of it. It's kind of unique. So I did find one of the pieces I came here to look for and it doesn't have an opening. So one of the subscribers told me that they're actually candy dishes. They're not fairy lamps. So I think she might be right on that. I don't know. I've got to check. I've got to check if it says Home Co. on both tops or bottoms because that wouldn't make sense. If but either way, definitely worth coming back because I found some cool stuff already. And I'm not even really into this, into the hunting yet. <laughs> kind of neat. These are pretty, they're like a basket. Crystal. Pretty. No, 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 no. Those are still here. A lot of this was here before. Got a pineapple lamp there. this. That's nice. It's actually in good condition for four dollars. This little shell dish Fitz and Floyd. That's cute. A little Fitz and Floyd shell dish. Oh, we got a little 
chin here. I kind of like the look of this frame, the way that that works. You know I'm getting this. Oh, she's oh, fabulous. She... <laughs> oh, she's a gourd. Yes, she's a gourd. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Do you want it? This is oh, kind she... of your style. No, 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 no. <laughs> I mean, what do you think? Oh, she's a, yes. <laughs> you, you want it? No. She's great. <laughs> okay, Steve. Steve wanted to come check this out last time and we didn't get out here. Oh, he did? This is kind of cool. Well, he didn't notice it until oh. later when we were leaving. He's like, I think you can actually go out there. So, I'm showing him now. Well, we thought we were nice last night. Well, oh, did you really? I sure did. Oh, like got some wood pieces oh, here. There's some old windows here. Can you take a bath? Yep. Bike. Look at that. Handsome bay, too. This is probably the temperature we're going to be dealing with in the. Oh, um, this is fine. We okay. Can worse than this. Right okay. I don't see anything I can't do without. Yeah, me too, either. So far, anyway. Do you want me to get that down for you, Kelly? Um. So you can look at it. Uh, Mike is probably at home right now. Yeah, that was his sunny day oh. I know nothing about bikes, but this does look vintage to me. But I know nothing about bikes. That definitely looks yeah, vintage. It says Huffy. Oh, we'll be $25 on that. I was kind of excited. For a minute, right? Yeah. Look at that window. That is cool. <laughs> that is very cool, that old window. Shopping. <laughs> okay, Catherine, I came back to get this piece. Whatever you need, he got if it ain't in there. Find out how much he wants for it. Now look at there is a little damage on it though. But it's not much. Oh no, there's quite a bit. Okay. We're gonna have to leave it behind. Too much damage on that. Just for you. Just for you. This is their first time here. Oh. Look at this guy. I'm here with the He's a, what do you call these things? A troll, troll. right? He's a troll. Oh my god. Isn't he cute? Oh. Oh, I know. There's uh, lots of great stuff here. He's always got a lot of good stuff. I like this piece up here. That's pretty. Uh, see, it's not. It fooled me. I thought it was old. It's not old. Ooh, look at that deer. That's awesome. Look at this. He's flocked. He's pretty. He's nice, isn't he? I think he might be the first thing in my pile. There's some more Halloween gnomes. Oh, yes, there are. But I'm not getting them. That witch is kind of cute. I know. I, I told Kelly that when she already got me to print. <laughs> he found a bunch of stuff. Oh, wow. I don't I need to find out if it works or not. Yeah, Okay. okay, we're back at Palmer. I told you I would do some filming in here for you. Kind of looking at some of the bags here. I'm going to look in here and see if we can find stuff. It's pretty.
This is interesting. I've never seen this kind of thing before. What is this? Huh. Interesting. Looks like it goes like this. It hangs on something. Some type of cleaner dispenser. This little rat. That's cute. These are pretty. That bean pot. Bean pots don't do real well, but I really like them. I think they just have a really pretty look. I think this is a napkin holder. I'm not sure. I looked at that last time. Here's a bottom to a Tupperware. Okay, so I talked to him about possibly working with me on pricing. That's a pretty box. That's cool. I like that. But all kinds of electrical devices. It's just aisle after aisle of stuff. You just have to come look and see what you can find. Got the blue bottles. All kinds of bottles. These are pretty. How much these are? This is really pretty right here. Would be better that rip, that kind of thing would be better with a set. Okay, please tell me these are glassy baby, right? No, it's not. <laughs> I don't know, someday, if I put it out there, someday. Look at this one with the angel. That's kind of cool. So here's what I'm trying to get him to negotiate on, is I want to pick up some of this and see if he'll come down on his pricing on it. I think I'm going to pull this piece too. He's got 25 on that though. I doubt he's going to come down much on that. I've got two pieces up there. We'll see how he does. I think I'm going to get one from my sister. She has one. All right, what else can we find in here? That's cool and interesting. That's Pampered Chef. We'll throw that in the pile. See, this kind of thing right here, he would probably be willing to go lower on, and it will help buffer the cost of other things. That, that's kind of cool. That says suds. Four dollars. That's kind of neat. Oh, look at that little clock. Let's see. Oh, that's cool looking. something here. Well, I think that's cool looking. It's got a cracked face, but very interesting. And what's this one here? That one's pretty neat. But you just have to dig. Let's see if you can find the treasures. There's all kinds of treasures in here. That's really 
And I like this set. A lot of people like that red canister set. Of course, you know me, I'm always going to go for the pottery. It's got damage on the bottom, but I'll take a closer look at it. What's this guy down here? What's this? Oh, it's the top to a canister. That's cute. So there's all kinds of tops there, too, if you're looking for a top and you're missing a top. There's some pretty ball jars. All kinds of littles. Oh, these are cool. That's cool. Very cool, though. <laughs> One's got a chip pretty big chip so I'd have to pass on that but all right look at this lady back here oh my gosh what is this that's pretty that's kind of got a cool look like that hmm I don't see a price. That might be a good one. I really like this. I feel like it's missing one shelf though. But that would be a great display piece. Kind of a cool display piece. There's furniture back in here. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? There's a pickle jar. Old magazine rack. It's kind of got some nice lines on it. Some old frames, bed frames. Here's some Crocs. That one's a hundred. I think I have some at home. I'm gonna make a decision on because I brought in that big piece of pottery, so I need to pull a croc out. I think either that or a barrel. I have barrels too, and I have big pickle jars too. So some nice ladders. They're cool. That's a big one. Could turn it into two ladders. Here's a trunk. Just walking y'all around so you get an idea of the place if you've never been here. That one's coming apart. That's a shame because that's a, that's actually kind of cool. But it's definitely definitely coming apart. And it would require some repair, which I don't feel like doing. There's some old. I don't know if it's paper or wallpaper. Or both paper and wallpaper trunks all kinds of chairs there's always plenty of chairs to be had you could really you know if you're looking for an interesting chair to switch things out you can take your time on that there's always chairs to be found here's a, a wicker wicker chair all kinds of artwork that's a good one that one's pretty. All right, let me get back over to the smaller items. It's a pretty chair. Coming apart a little bit. I like the look on that. There's a little Coca-Cola crate. 
This is pretty. It's $5. I really think it's pretty. It's Christmas. If there's no chips on it, that might be a possibility. And look at this Campbell's. That's kind of cute. For the Campbell's Soup Collector. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. And that says vintage. Let's go. Eight dollars. It's kind of cute with the ducks. I think that's cute enough. We're gonna get that. Now in this room, you're gonna find more of the items that are priced well. Um, I love this piece. It's, I think, $75 if I remember correctly. But I love it. It's got such a great mid-century modern look. $70, yeah. It's a Hager. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous piece. All kinds of milk glass. Colored glass, your blue and white, some clear glass items, some stoppers, carnival glass, all of the lamps, some more carnival glass. This looks like Avon mostly there. Avon items. What's this guy? He's cute. McCoy. Some buttons. It's a pretty lamp. So many wonderful pieces if you want to come check them out paul mart and dunn not too far from i-95 that's three dollars blue and white vase i might get that okay we made another stop after leaving paul mart this is called Saks thrift ave it's a consignment shop so there is no no negotiation on pricing because they're selling them for other people. But I just wanted to show you, there are some beautiful blow molds in here. This cute Halloween tree. These are cute. I wonder how much these are. $3, I, I might get those for $3. I think they're cute enough. Um, I'll plug them in and see if they work. Ooh. That's four dollars. But there's a really nice look at this one. It's really in good condition. Very good condition. These are more faded. She said that was 75. Look at this lamp. That's cool. Green glass. It's a picture, pretty fall picture there. It's frames. Little llama. Kinds of brass. I hope you all enjoyed that. Wasn't that just a great day of hunting? 
We had such a great time. I can't wait to share all the treasures that we found with you. We found some great stuff. So come back in a couple days and we'll go over all of those items in detail. Until then, everybody, get out there, find yourself your own treasure, put a smile on your face and take care.